I know. <laughs> <laughs> Thailand. You are you, hot. And your sun is bright. Woof. Yeah. Dorothy, where are we? Thailand. We are in Thailand, in the city of? Krabi. Yeah. First time here. First time in Thailand. We flew here from Singapore. Where are we? <laughs> no, we're not a PG. Where are we? Not in Tonga. Where are we? Are we in Singapore? Yeah, we're in Thailand. And gotta admit, I thought we were getting better at traveling. I think we're getting worse. We almost missed our flight. We almost missed the flight. Most stressful hours of our life. So we're we like... just misjudged how far the airport was from our hotel. Cooking it in the taxi and then we get to the airport and there's big long lines and our kids are going nuts and every person at the airport is looking at us like, you guys have too, too many kids. <laughs> Which is funny because as soon as we've got, been walking around the streets of Krabi, everybody's like, oh, two kids, do you want more? Do you, do you want more? So, in case you're wondering if we've been working out, I think it's pretty obvious. <laughs> so, since we've been here, we've done some pretty cool things already. Oh my gosh. This is the mistake we keep making. We'll get to a place and we'll have scheduled like four, to four days to a week at this destination. And then we get here and we wish we could be here for like an entire month. Yeah. I could be in this city of Krabi for an entire month and still want to be here for longer. There's so much to do here. Everything's very inexpensive and affordable. The food is delicious. So we're staying at a great hotel. It's called Peace Laguna Resort. And spa. And spa. It's really nice. It's been, they've been super kind and welcoming and great with our kids. And yeah, you can tell it's a good family place. So like a lot of the other people here are just families. Which, I'm just going to tell you, one of my favorite things about all of these adventures so far has been seeing Dorothy mature and just become super social. Everywhere we go, she'll see little kids and immediately it's, Dad, look, new friends. This resort's done a really good job of kind of like building into the land in a beautiful way. We're situated right by the beach, right by the town, and then by this giant mountain of a cliff. One of the first things we did was went and got um, some pampering. Dorothy, I had told Dorothy that she could get her nails done when we got to Thailand and she was so stoked to get her little blue fingernails painted. Little blue sparkle Cinderella fingernails. And she picked out hot Barbie pink for me. Yeah. So we're rocking it at the, at getting our nails done. I didn't stuff. do anything in the And then the of market. course Garrett <laughs> sees all these like braided things like they do in like the Bahamas and the Caribbean and he got his braids in. No, this is how it was. So I'm just walking like a tough guy around town <laughs> and I see these just manly braids and I'm like yeah. So I spit out my beef jerky <laughs> and I got my hair braided like a man, like Alan Iverson. With green. And I got green in it because we're in Thailand and everything in Thailand is very green. Yeah. Ocean has a slight beautiful tint of green in it. The mountains are very green. Everything's a little green. I don't know what to think of my life when my husband is like using hair accessories and getting his hair braided. Okay, but... Carly real... Homo, what do you do? <laughs> real talk for a second. I'm always wearing a headband to keep my hair out of my face. I don't... Hair can't touch my face. All right, so then we, uh, they have these beautiful, I think they're called long tail boats, at least in English. That's how it translates. And there's just these Thai boats that can take you all around to these beautiful islands.
so yeah, Jess and I hired a little private long tail boat to take us, and it's gorgeous out there. Did some snorkeling. Um, Visited some beaches, did some snorkeling. There's really cool rock climbing that you can do up these cliffs. Garrett's pretty proud of himself because he got stung by a jellyfish. Did, okay, just picture the scariest thing you've ever seen attaching to your face and just sucking the life out of you. He wouldn't let me so fix the problem. Pain. He kept whining about how much it hurt, but I was like, let me help you. And he's like, yeah, pee uh -uh. on my face. <laughs> 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 Last night was one of the coolest things I feel like I've done this whole trip, which was a night market down it, like in town in Karabi, and it was just phenomenal food, music, shopping. Dorothy was loving it. Dorothy is a weirdo. <laughs> so Dorothy, uh, this cute little local family that showed us around the market, they bought Dorothy this like balloon caterpillar. caterpillar. And I, it just transformed her. Immediately she became like invisible when she's holding this caterpillar. She walked around and just started Shoved poking it. people in the face. She Adults, wanted to show everybody she was like, Mah. locals, strangers, she just started poking people in the face. You're weird, Dorothy. Okay, and then Manila. Manila's two favorite things to watch while we were at this market was one, the karaoke. Manila was loving the karaoke. And then, I don't know if you saw this, but there's this dude juggling and practicing to be a bartender. So he had like, I think they're called the mixers and like yeah. the wine bottle or whatever it was. Probably not. Probably like We don't alcohol. drink. We don't know. <laughs> um, anyways, he's like juggling them and doing like fancy bartender stuff. And Manila was just so cool. <laughs> Manila was just staring at him the whole time. Oh, that night market was the coolest thing. If you ever in Thailand, um, oh, for sure, you gotta for sure visit. go to a night market. So, I guess all we have to say is we love Thailand. We're excited for the last few days we have to explore here. And if you're ever in the area, for sure go to Krabi. For sure take the day boat to the different islands and beaches. Visit the market and Definitely, especially if you're either like on your honeymoon or with your family, this resort, this is the place to be. It's fun. So yeah, check out our uh, nice view from our little cottage. Yeah, let us show you our nice little uh, neighborhood here in Thailand. Thanks guys, see ya.